Hi Aries, Tarot Twins here. Welcome to your soulmate reading. So this is going to be a reading entitled, What Will Your Soulmate Look Like? Okay, so we're going to lay out some cards. I'm joined by Black Feather Tarot. Hi guys. And we're going to be using three different decks. I'm going to list them below. Um, we'll jump into the reading straight into it and see what's coming up for you. What is your um, soulmate going to look like? Let's... Let's see what we can find. So we're looking at their characteristics. Yes. Um, their features. Yeah, okay, absolutely. Let's kick off with the um, um, this card here. Okay, there's a very intimidating stare to this person. Straight away I'm getting an intimidating energy. If you can see the bird here, um, I'm seeing someone with a low brow or a very prominent brow. I'm seeing thick eyebrows mm -hmm. actually here with this person. An intense stare. An intense stare, but quite a, um, a serious facial expression to them. Okay, so very sunken in or stern features. Um, I'm seeing, you can see the beak, okay, the, the thinness of the face. I'm mm -hmm. seeing sunken in cheeks and um, a very defined brow to this person, okay, here as well. Um, prominent nose? Yeah, I'm seeing a prominent nose as well. And, um, okay, so we see the the very thin legs, so I'm getting this person could be quite slender. Um, not overly thin, but I am seeing that this person is quite um, quite a slender person. But mm -hmm. um, something about the eyes, I see dark brown, very full eyes with the bird here. So I feel like eyes, um, eyes wise, this person has dark eyes. I mean, over here we can see with the energy, there's, there's a very um, voluptuous, okay, very sensual shape to this person. So um, for some of you, especially if you're after a female here, um, a very voluptuous, very Venus-like shape um, with this priestess here. Now, um, I'm seeing long hair, very long hair, mm -hmm. Medusa-like hair. Um, you can see with the trees emerging around her. So I'm seeing bushy, frizzy hair okay it's a little bit wild it's untamed or it's hard to maintain in a way um that's what i'm getting uh with with hair here a unique i'm picking up like a unique dress sense oh They've got okay their own style um it's not always what's trendy but i feel like it's um their dress sense or even the way that they do their makeup feels like an artistic expression there's something very artistic very flowy very creative about this person's energy okay um quite yeah quite voluptuous i feel like quite, they sort of they float when they walk is what i'm picking up yeah, okay, so the, a bit of a strut maybe. Yeah, okay, maybe so a bit of a strut. bit yeah. of a strut. Um, there's very blue eyes in this image. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you can see, but they almost look artificially blue. So I'm seeing mm -hmm. contacts for Possibly someone contacts, here. Yeah. yeah, or they just, like to... Yeah, like the steely blue eyes. Yeah, they're, they're like really... The ocean blue. Yeah, it's really, really electric, really intense. Um is what I'm getting here. They may even dye their hair blue, okay? Mm -hmm. So, because they do, you mentioned that quirkiness, and yeah, I think they've got it. Artistic, that, yeah. yeah, that sense of expression is what yeah. I'm picking up as well. And they could have a curl to their hair here, here mm -hmm. as um, as well. But let's move on to the next card here. Straight away, I'm seeing someone with something to do with posture or their back. Okay, so she's hunched over, as you can see in the cards here. So I'm thinking someone who may have a very defined... Um, hunch in their back, okay, it, perhaps something with their posture. posture, perhaps due to labor, um, to some, could be, yeah, yes, the labor that they do maybe, or have done in the past here, or, um, they may have back problems as well here, yeah, what I'm picking up on. Yep. back problems, maybe they go to physio here regularly to sort of get checkups here, I'm also picking that up as well, um, yeah, I, I get more the back thing um, with her leaning over here, but um, they could also have quite a stress or like a highly strung energy to them, but it shows up in their face. I think you can see the wrinkles in her dress. I mean, this is long flowy things, so I think maybe this person likes to wear long flowy garments, skirts, mm -hmm. um, shirts, you know, oversized things. Mm -hmm. So straight away get oversized shirts. Um, but you can see she's got she's got a real elegance to her. So, and she's wearing, she's actually wearing a mask. So it could be that this person wears a lot of makeup or they put something on their face, maybe glasses, maybe some sort of facial but accessory. Again, I'm just tying that into, to me, yeah, it's more artistic expression. Yeah, you know, like the way I they think so. Or the way they dye their hair, it's more as, um, you know, they're, to express their individuality or their sense of expression here. Yeah, I think so too. Let's see what else we can find. Okay, so. Okay, eye makeup. Mm-hmm. A lot of eye makeup with that next card here. 
Okay, again, the brown eyes. Eyes, yeah. eyes are a very prominent feature with this individual. Quite an and intense brow. stare. Um, even in the way, in, I feel like, in which the two of you might meet, I feel like it'll be your eyes will connect across a crowded room here. Brown or blue eyes is coming through here, or con contact contact. Yeah, they I may think have brown eyes. Brown. And then, yeah, they may put in contact lenses here. Um, I'm getting that this person, yeah, I'm seeing a lot of like intense makeup. Like they may do the winged uh, eyeliner, the, the little mm. cat flick here for females. Um, yeah, yeah. I'm seeing that. Very too. attractive. I'm also getting almond shaped eyes. Almond shaped eyes, exactly. Um, they've got very attractive eyes, very alluring eyes. They've got a very intense stare here, almost like a hypnotic stare, right? I would say their eyes are their most distinct feature to this Definitely person. Definitely their most attractive feature, yes. It's really, yeah, it's really a standout um, kind of vibe here. Okay, so straight away, a lot of color. Okay, we've got illumination here. So a lot of color. Um, coming through here, a very so colorful personality. Yeah, it could be a colorful personality coming up. Um, colorful hair. Colorful hair. Co very colorful, colorful makeup. Makeup. Colorful clothes. This person, they seem a little bit eccentric. Like they yeah. seem very um, quirky or very a little out bit there different here. than you're normally used to. A little bit different. I'm also getting gender fluid. Maybe this yeah. person is bisexual here. I'm getting gender fluidity. Mardi Gras has come to mind. It is coming up here. Yeah, over in Oz. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and she's got like this crown. I'm seeing some some um, pieces. Yeah, some headpieces here. She's yeah. This one also had some sort of you know headpiece here. So yeah, I'm like... seeing the headpiece, and I see light, light, um, very light hair that sort of comes over her uh, fringe. I'm they, seeing a fringe, fringe here. They dye their hair. I feel like it's hard to know their natural color because I feel yeah. like again it's this form of artistic expression. Um, Quite artistic, they wear maybe though. flowers in their hair or have a tattoo okay, of a yeah, flower. Tattoos, I think, um, possibly. Specific to tattoos of a flower or wanting to get a tattoo of a flower here. Yeah, I think okay. that's the vibe I'm getting. All right. Um, okay, next card. We've got red hair. Red blonde, strawberry blonde. Red hair coming up here. Or possibly blue hair. Again, we're getting the sense of dyed. There's a lot of um, are they butterflies. They're birds. They're birds. Could be a tattoo of a bird. Could be a tattoo of a bird or a rose here. Um, again, there's this fluidity to this card, isn't there? They've got this flow. They're very flowy, um, loose-fitted clothing here. Yeah. Very, like, almost like a beachy style, artsy expression. I'm seeing a large chest or very good pectoral muscles. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay. Quite busty for feet. Yeah. Or quite like... Uh, in shape for yeah, male for, here. Yeah, and um, quite athletic. Quite athletic, or it's they're originally slim, they're originally slender, but they build muscle quite well. Um, so I think they're they're fairly um they're fairly in shape, is what I they get. I don't see shape. anyone overweight. I'm getting quite pale um, or porcelain skin, yeah. very light skin, or very fair. Yeah, very fair, fair complexion. Light skin, fair complexion. Could be freckles skin. here as well. Could be yeah, it could be um, yeah, orange hair. You know the fair skin here. Yeah. Oh, so I hope this helps everyone. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you in. guys for tuning in. Thank you for watching and listening. If you'd like a private reading with the both of us, we are currently accepting those um, limited availability. So please feel free to email one of us. I'll list both emails below um, and we'll be in touch. Otherwise, um, take care. Have a wonderful March. Bye for now.